When you finally walk away, watch for these four stages of narcissistic despair. Everyone. Navigating the aftermath of a relationship with a narcissist is akin to embarking on a multifaceted journey filled with a range of emotional experiences. Those who have survived such relationships grapple with emotions like betrayal, confusion, and self-doubt. As they progress toward healing, the profound impact of narcissistic abuse on their psyche becomes increasingly apparent. In this intricate emotional landscape, individuals find strength, support, and a pathway to reclaiming their identity. On the flip side, the narcissist, severed from their primary source of supply, those through a unique set of stages that diverge from the anticipated remorse and self-reflection. Notably absent are the expected feelings of guilt or recognition of wrongdoing. Instead, the narcissist undergoes a mysterious progression through four distinct stages, a journey we're about to unravel. These stages offer insight into the narcissist's psyche as they grapple with the disruption to their typical cycle of manipulation and control. Join me as we explore the complexities of the narcissist's reaction to abandonment. Intrigued? Prepare for an expedition through the enigmatic corridors of the narcissistic mind. Don't forget to subscribe for informative content and to raise awareness about the nuanced intricacies of narcissistic abuse. Now let's dive into the main discussion. This isn't an isolated journey, it's a shared odyssey. So don't hesitate, like, subscribe for a continuous stream of insightful content, and share your thoughts in the comments below. Your active participation is the lifeblood of our community, echoing with each interaction. 1. The Victim Act Picture the opening scene where the narcissist takes center stage as the eternal victim. Once you exit, they don the cloak of victimhood, spinning tales of woe tailored to their twisted reality. This narrative, though entirely skewed, becomes their unwavering truth. Crossing their path unwittingly casts you as the villain in this drama. Their goal? To garner sympathy and present themselves as the most unfortunate souls on the planet. Sadly, those with empathetic hearts often fall into this trap. Unaware that this dramatic performance is just the initial step in ensnaring someone new. Adding a layer of perplexity is the fact that the narcissist genuinely believes their own lies while playing the victim. They master the art of self gaslighting convincing themselves that they are the hapless victims of someone else's schemes. Their stories of abandonment and mistreatment focus on their wounded ego, conveniently sidestepping any acknowledgement of the impact of their actions on others. 2. The Jealousy Game Now, shift to the second act, the jealousy game. The narcissist becomes engrossed in your reactions, turning your life into their personal soap opera. They take pleasure in flaunting their new partner, especially online, aiming to sting you with self-doubt and question your worth. This calculated move is designed to tie you up in knots and complicate your ability to move on. They parade their new partner on social media, stage holiday spectacles, and integrate the new person into their family, leaving you bewildered because you were always kept a secret. But don't let it get under your skin. It's a meticulously staged show, a facade to mess with your emotions. Their primary goal isn't necessarily to build a new life, but to exact revenge on you. It's a vindictive act to maintain their perceived dominance. Remember, it's all smoke and mirrors. This act is just another scene in their drama. 3. The Hoovering Attempt Now onto the enigmatic third act, the Hoovering Phase. This is where the narcissist grapples with the reality of your newfound independence sensing a threat to their control as you break free. Your journey toward a new chapter undermines their power, built on your suffering, where they revel in feeling potent and in control. Witnessing your progress becomes unbearable for them. Hence, they might send a seemingly random, cryptic message, aiming to disrupt your progress and pull you back into the familiar drama. Hoovering is their desperate attempt to reclaim control. Stay vigilant, and don't let the smoke and mirrors of their drama cloud your newfound independence. 4. The Smear Campaign Venturing deeper into the labyrinth of the smear campaign, it's vital to dissect the psychological tactics deployed by narcissists in this phase. Beyond simple manipulation, 
they skillfully exploit the vulnerabilities within relationships, crafting an intricate tapestry of lies and half-truths. Narcissists aim to erode your credibility with friends and family. The convoluted narrative they construct serves to emotionally and socially isolate you, intensifying the impact of their toxic influence. This calculated move isn't just about tarnishing your reputation. It's also about amassing a legion of supporters on their side. In distressing instances, this manipulation proves effective, leaving survivors of narcissistic abuse grappling with isolation precisely when they need a support network the most. Picture the emotional toll as those around you succumb to the orchestrated campaign, prompting you to question the authenticity of your closest relationships. Shifting from interpersonal dynamics to the broader psychological landscape, it becomes clear that narcissists navigate post-relationship fallout with a stark contrast to typical emotional processes. Unlike individuals undergoing grief stages or experiencing pain and crisis, narcissists showcase an unsettling ability to swiftly detach and move on. This detachment stems from their fundamental inability to form authentic emotional bonds. The absence of genuine attachment underscores that the love they claim to feel was a facade, a tool used for manipulation. Consequently, the aftermath of the relationship holds little emotional weight for them. Their life unfolds as if on autopilot, lacking the depth of genuine experience. It's crucial to grasp that their apparent ease in removing you from their thoughts underscores the disposability of your role in their narrative. In their world, connections are transactional, lacking authentic emotional investment. Concluding this exploration, it's paramount to recognize the profound dissociative tendencies inherent in narcissistic individuals. Their inability to forge real connections and experience genuine emotions manifests in their detached and superficial approach to life. Their narrative unfolds like a scripted play, devoid of the depth and authenticity characterizing human existence. Understanding this facet sheds light on the complexities of dealing with a narcissist, reinforcing the importance of seeking support from those who can offer genuine empathy and understanding. These individuals follow a predictable pattern. First, they adopt the victim role, then attempt to incite jealousy. If that fails, they might try to pull you back into their orbit and ultimately resort to launching extensive smear campaigns. Thank you for being part of this insightful exploration. Your engagement is highly appreciated. If you found value in this discussion, do hit the like button and subscribe for more wisdom. For just $1, Consider becoming a channel member to enjoy exclusive perks and support us in delivering valuable content on navigating challenging situations and fostering personal growth. Your attention is immensely valued, and your support empowers us to continue providing insightful content to our community. Thank you for being part of our journey.